Hi friends, welcome to Learn with Krishna Sandeep channel. In this video, we'll see how to reverse an array in Java. So we'll write a program to reverse an array in Java. So uh, for example, if you are giving an array of, okay, one, comma two, comma three, comma four, comma five. So the output should come as five comma four comma three comma two comma one. Okay, this is how it should come. So whenever we give the input array as one, two, three, four, five, the output should be five, four, three, two, one. So in order to do this program, so we'll first understand the logic, how we will do, and then finally we'll write the code for that. Okay. So first what we'll do, we'll take a array of one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Now in order to reverse the array, uh, which is there, uh, which is given I mean, in the given array. So what we need to do is create a new array. Okay create a new array and whatever the first element is there in the uh, original array put it at the last okay put it at the last and uh, whatever the second element is there put it at last but one okay whatever the third element is there put it at the okay last but two element okay third element whatever the fourth is there just add the elements or put the elements from the reverse side in a new array five okay so the last one is five now if you see the array is reversed so what we need to do we need to iterate over the original array okay and at the same time create a new array and add the elements from the last position so that's how the array will get reversed so hope you understand the logic now let's what we will do we'll write the program here so how do we write the program first create a new array so how do you create a new array int array equal to 10 comma 20 comma 30 comma 40 comma 50 now what we need to do we need to okay write a method called reverse which will accept the array okay which will accept the array this reverse method will take array and just add all this inside the main method okay create and initialize the array and at the same time add the elements in an array so now we have created a method okay we are calling the method now what we'll do we'll create a method called reverse just right click quick fix and it will create a method so this method will accept integer array okay
so now let's create a reverse method okay so here what we are going to do we are going to create a new array okay so we'll create a or we'll name it as reverse array int reverse array equal to new int of so what will be the size of the new array so it will be like of size original array int array dot length now let's see what is the error we are getting cannot from uh, from new int array okay here we need to give integer array now what we need to do we need to iterate over the each and every element okay and now what we need to do is just say int index equal to size of the array i'll tell you what is the purpose of this index now what we are going to do iterate over the original array for int i equal to 0 i less than n i plus plus okay now here what we need to do is okay add the elements so reverse add the elements from the okay reverse side so reverse of j minus or index minus 1 equal to array of i so for int i equal to 0 i less than and n is nothing but array dot length okay so here what we are doing we are just saying reverse array of index minus 1 equal to array of i and finally what we need to do we need to decrement the index so index equal to index minus 1 okay now what we need to do we need to print the original array and reverse array so just say original array equal to is dot to spring of array and just copy this line and say this as reverse array array is dot to spring of reverse array okay so hope you understand the logic what we are trying to do so let's run the program and see the output so our output should come as 50 40 30 20 and 10 run the program and see the output so original array is 10 20 30 40 50 and reverse array is 50 40 30 10 10 and 10 now let's debug the program and we'll see the output how it comes so first what we are doing we are creating a new array okay first we'll uh, have an array original array with the elements and in the second step what we are going to do we are going to create a new array which is same as same size as original array okay so now if you see the reverse array is created of size of how much what is the size of this array same as the original array and the elements are like all zeros why because we have taken it as an int, int array so since it is a primitive so the default value is all zeros now what we need to do the next step go to the next step just say the index variable so the index variable is nothing but the size of the original array now what we are going to do we are going to iterate over this array 10 20 30 40 50 and then what we are doing now we are inserting the first element of this array to the reverse array if you see here reverse array do you see any elements over here no 
okay all are zeros now what we are going to do we are going to add this element to the reverse array so what is the first element of the array of i array of 0 which is 10 so if you see here array of i is nothing but 10 let me put it here and add it to the watch so if you see array of element is the 10 now this is copied to where reverse array of index minus 1 so this is 10 now why because it is copied now index value is decremented initially index is how much 5 I'm just putting this as well as to the watch so index is 5 after this line index will become 4 after execution of this line now again go to the next statement I mean next line next execution so now I initially we are completed with first index i is equal to 0 we are completed that now i got incremented right so i will be 1 so 1 is less than 5 true okay and it comes to the next statement now if you see here array of 1 what is the array of first position 20 take this element 20 okay take this element 20 and add it to the reverse array so now the reverse array of index minus 1 is 0 right so now this needs to be added to index minus 1 so what is the index here 4 4 minus 1 is 3 so this will be okay now 20 will be added to the second last position similarly all the elements will be added in the reverse position for a new array so hope you understand this video thanks for watching my video if you like my video don't forget to subscribe to my video thank you subscribe to my channel